Welcome back to Ballhead and Metal, guys. My name is Joseph. Today we're doing a new reaction to a new band called Dark Woods of Dark Woods of My Betrothed, the song in Evil Sickness and in Grief. Now I know it's a side project from some of the main guys from Nightwish. Sorry, I don't remember all the names by heart. I know it's their side project, and I know this is black metal. And a couple of you guys already know down in the comments, I'm quite fond of black metal. So I'm going to be looking forward to what kind of style they're going to do here. I'm sure that the keyboards and symphonies are going to play a role in their music because that was kind of the basis for Nightwish, and I'm sure it's going to translate here. But it'll be interesting to see what else, what other elements that are different from Nightwish that they introduce here besides, obviously, the harsher music. Let's get into it. That's a dope cover. That is a dope drawing. The woman with the drums. Oh man, that's really cool. You know, I miss really good covers from heavy metal bands. I believe like the, the, the 90s and 80s have much better covers and this, this is a really dope cover. Oh, it's a new album. Okay. This reminds me a lot of uh, Demo Burger. Right away, I thought of Demo Burger because they like using that symphonic sound along with the kind of harsher heavy metal, black metal sound. This is really old school black metal. This is like the beginnings. Like this reminds me of Emperor too. It's like, uh, like yeah, the really old school approach to it. I'm not sure. I'm not gonna harsh it just yet, be a harsh critic just yet because I don't know how the song is gonna evolve. I typically get bored of like that dark, like old school dark funeral Emperor sound. Uh, because it's the same blast beats and the same rhythm. Like I, I needed to change it. Something happened within black metal, which is why I typically gravitate towards something like Immortal, that um, withstand the fall of time and Sons of Northern Darkness. But let's see, let's see. I'm, I'm, I'm reserving my judgment as of now. Yeah, I really do like that keyboard in the background and that building like somberness or like that moodiness with uh basically I'm enjoying everything that has to do with the keyboard. Uh the guitar and drums, they kind of I understand they're trying to go for that old school sound where you kind of 
it's it's not overproduced and it has that kind of rougher sound to the music but i don't think it's doing it any favors to be honest I've also I've always been of the belief that uh, I do like really heavy music, but it has to be like interesting still. For example, I feel like Nile is one of the heaviest bands ever, but they're just so intricate with their with their with their songwriting, uh, especially in their later albums. There is just and they have really interesting riffs and they have moments of breaking from the speed and I don't know. The, the song seems like overly simplistic, like almost almost too faithful to the old school black metal which i am never been a fan of um that's why i skipped the first few albums actually from immortal uh, i like stuff like uh, melakesh i like naglfar i like demo burger um i think of other black metal bands that i really like off the top of my head witchery well it's not more of a like melodic death metal black metal but yeah, I like when there's progressions in the music, even within black metal. Dark Fortress, I like a lot. Um, but so far, I mean, I, I don't mean to sound like like the guy who's just bitching the whole time and complaining about a song. But if you came for a reaction, you want to know my reaction is, it's, I'm s struggling to find something positive to say. That's a fucking dope transition. It's also, you know what I actually do like 
uh, I like that it's not satanic metal. Uh, typically, right, a lot of black metal, but back in the day, was all about satanism and occultism and all this kind of crap. Uh, I tend to not a big be a big fan of that. And if a band is occult or satanic, uh, if it's like Behemoth, where it's like more for the artistic expression, it's cool. But when they're like true believers, like Gorgoroth or Mayhem uh, or Burzum, I'm I'm not a fan usually. Just because of what everything happened in Norway with all the church burnings, all that stupid shit. Um, despite being not religious myself. Uh, yeah, I, I appreciate that they're just going for more... It's more dark lyrics, which, which is always cool. Yeah, that's such a dope transition. It just came so late in the song. And the song for an eight minute song did not need to be this long. Um, I think it would have been much in much better service to the song to be shorter. So yeah, like I'm I'm pretty much bored by the end. Wow, this must this might be my, my, my harshest reactions. I don't really don't mean to be like that, but I'm like that's my initial feelings that I'm getting right now. Perhaps other songs in the album would be much better than this. But this this song, like I'm I'm literally just listening to the end just to get to the end of the reaction so I can get all my thoughts together. It looks like it's gonna play out play out this rhythm, right? Yeah, I don't like this song at all. There's this moments in it that I like, uh, that were interesting. And honestly speaking, there's thought behind it. It's not like it's like without thought and without a direction, but I just really don't like the direction. And, and I think it stems from the fact that I just don't like that style of black metal. Um, there's certain bands, I know they're legendary, I know they're, they're big. I've never liked, I li and I, like I say, I like a certain type of black metal and it's this is not it because there's nothing really happening in this song there's a couple of transitions there's nothing really interesting going on the, the arrangement of the instruments to me is like it's just not it i don't know yeah sorry for all the fans of this sorry if i'm being a little harsh but what can you do well i can't say you hopefully enjoyed this reaction but at the very least you saw my thought process of what i thought about it uh, you can check out my other reactions on this channel if, you, if you're new to the channel, if you're willing to give it a try. Because typically, I, I like most of the things I'm shown. Um, I can be critical, but I like it. This might be one of the... This and a couple of other ones, like Blind Channel, I wasn't a big fan of. Anywho, any, either way, guys, enjoy the rest of your day. And just keep it metal out there.